Good evening, my dear brothers and sisters. Let us start this time of praise and worship, and let us start by signing ourselves in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 Gracious and loving Father, we praise and thank you with all our hearts. Yes, Lord. We thank you, Almighty God, for your love, for your mercy, your kindness. Lord, as we begin this time of praise and worship, this time that we spend with you, Lord, we prepare our unworthy selves to come before you, my God. Yes, Lord. And so, Lord Jesus, in faith, each and every one of us come to the foot of your cross on Calvary. Yes, yes Lord Jesus. Bowing at your feet of mercy, we cover ourselves in your most precious blood. Yes, Lord. Yes, right Lord. from yes, the Lord. crown of our yes, heads Lord. to the very soles of our feet. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Lord, we claim total protection for us, for our families, and everything that you've bestowed upon us. Yes, Lord Jesus. By the power of your most precious blood, O oh Lord, we take authority and we bind every evil spirit of slumber, of distraction, of wandering, of all things that keep us away from you, Lord. Yes, Lord. And in the power of your most holy name, we bind it and cast it out of this place and send it bound to your feet, Lord Jesus. Yes, Lord where you will decide what to do with them yes, Lord. by the power of your most precious blood and by your very presence here my god this place this time this space is now holy ground amen amen, amen. amen. praise amen. you lord thank you jesus thank you father hallelujah, hallelujah. hallelujah lord praise, praise and glory be to your name lord thank you father we glorify your name, O Lord. We bless your holy name, O Lord. Thank you, Jesus. You are the mighty God. You are the Lord of Lords. You are the King of Kings. You are the Alpha and the Omega. There is none like you, my God. There is none like you. There is no other that can compare to you, my God. You are worthy of our praise and our thanksgiving, of all the honor and the glory, Lord. We praise you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Lord. Praise you, Lord. My dear brothers and sisters, Isaiah 25 verse 1 says, Lord, you are my God. I will exalt you and praise your name. For in perfect faithfulness, you have done wonderful things, things planned long ago. Yes, my dear brothers and sisters, the Lord has done wonderful things for us and planned long before. What, this, what Isaiah is talking about is the greatest gift God has given us. And that is of God's love of his very own beloved son here to die for us. And that is the greatest gift, my God. And so, my dear brothers and sisters, let us begin this time of praise and worship by singing this song of gratitude and gratefulness to God. We sing this song, Grateful. Oh 
giving in all the glory and honor. Yes, Lord. Amen. The book of Genesis reminds us that in the beginning of time, God fashioned, he made the whole world. And on the sixth day, he fashioned man out of earth. And when he made him in his own image and likeness, he put his breath into his lungs and man lived. Amen. 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 So, my dear brothers and sisters, let us know and let us believe in our hearts that we are no ordinary creatures because our Lord and our God has put His breath into us. Amen. 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 And my dear brothers and sisters, even as, this, as I speak these words, it reminds me of all our brothers and sisters back home and all over the world who are suffering with this virus who are struggling for breath on ventilators and in, on oxygen mask. Even as we sing this song of grat gratefulness and praise to our God, let us also make it a prayer to Him to bless all these brothers and sisters and claim their healing as we sing this song, Great Are You, Lord. So we pour out our 
Holy Spirit. Yes, Lord. It is your breath in our lungs, and we so we pour out our praise to you, my God. And there's so much, Lord, that we praise you for. You are that wonderful and awesome God. Amen. Yes, Lord. It is you who fashioned us, Lord. It is you who formed us. Yes, Lord. And as your word says, Lord, that you have knit our innards in our mother's womb, Lord. Amen. You have formed us in our mother's womb. Thank you, Lord. And you know us inside out, Lord. Amen. Yes, Lord. And yes, even though we know this time and again, we do things that displease you, Father God. We try to hide our sin or do, sometimes we do not even acknowledge our sin before you, my God. Yes, Lord Jesus. My dear brothers and sisters, very wisely, Proverbs 28, 13 tells us, whoever conceals their sins does not prosper, but the one who confesses and renounces them finds mercy. Amen. 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 Lord, right now we come to your feet. We come to the foot of your cross, Lord, the only place where there is mercy flowing, Lord. Yes, Lord Jesus. We ask your forgiveness for all our sins, for all our wrongdoings, Lord. Yes, Lord. For there are so many ways in which we have displeased you, my Father. Yes, Lord. Lord, we come here to say we are sorry and we repent. And Lord, we want to turn away from all our wicked ways. We want to live that life for you that is pleasing to you, my God, because this life is given by you, Lord. Yes, Lord Jesus. You paid the price for this life, Lord, that we have. Thank you, Thank Lord. You, Lord. And then Jesus. it's not ours anymore, Lord. It belongs to you, my God. Yes, yes Lord Jesus. Lord. Help us, Lord. Give us that grace. We ask for your grace in this moment, Lord to turn away from all that is evil and to walk in your path. Yes, Lord. My dear brothers and sisters, it is not easy for us to walk in complete righteousness unless we have the grace of God. Yes, yes Lord. Lord. Let us come right now to the foot of the cross, surrendering everything to him, surrendering our life to him and telling him, Lord, we are making that 180 degree turn coming back to you, Lord, because we want you as we take this song, Lord, my dear brothers and sisters, at the cross, let us come to this place of mercy at the foot of the cross and ask for his grace and strength, surrendering our whole life to him and asking him to empower us to turn away from all that is not of his kingdom. Yes, Jesus.
that we live my God yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. we thank you Lord for being such a merciful and wonderful God you. yes, Lord. yes Lord. you're always you, Lord. there Lord for us yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. always yes, willing Lord. to help us yes, to reach out to us my God yes, yes Lord. Lord. you're so wonderful you're so beautiful you. you're an awesome God yes, my Lord, Lord. Lord. Yes, thank you. Thank you. my dear brothers and sisters even when Jesus was about to go from this world he knew that we wouldn't be able to manage without the Holy Spirit even his apostles were just ordinary fishermen even after his death and resurrection but not until they received the power of the Holy Spirit and my dear brothers and sisters, if Jesus knows the need of the Holy Spirit in our lives, how much more should we know and believe and understand that we need the Holy Spirit? Yes, Lord. Let us now come to the Holy Spirit. Let us ask Him to come and take control of our lives. Holy Spirit, come Holy Spirit and take control of our lives. Take control of everything, of every area of our life, not just our time with you, Lord, but overall in every area, Lord, our personal life, our family life, our work life, everything, Jesus. We surrender it all to you, my God. We ask you to come and take control, Holy Spirit. You are welcome here in our lives and in our hearts. Under 
your presence, Lord. Holy Spirit, you are welcome here. Come flood this place and fill the atmosphere. Your glory, God, is what our hearts long for. To be
filled with the power of the holy spirit my dear brothers and sisters we are a new creation in the lord yes lord, yes, lord. Amen. for the word of god says he sends forth his spirit and they are created and he renews the face of the earth amen so each one of us filled with the holy spirit are a new creation right now amen amen, amen. my dear brothers and sisters if we are filled with the holy spirit there is only one thing that the spirit can lead us to and that is to worship our god he worship let us worship him let us come in this time before him to worship and honor him to adore him to give him all that praise and that glory for he deserves it my dear brothers and sisters Our God is a great God, great, mighty, and powerful. He's seated on His throne right now and always. Let us come, washed in the precious blood of the Lamb. Let us dare and enter into His holiness, and let us come with our heads bowed down, my dear brothers and sisters. I request each and every one of you to close your eyes. bow your heads before god right now for he is truly present here Amen. not by my words but by his word my dear brothers and sisters yes. for his word says wherever two or three are gathered in my name there i am amen and he is present here in our midst amen so let us come before him see him with our eyes of faith and worship him as we take this next song hallelujah
presence of the Lord for a moment. Let us keep a moment of silence for his word says, be still and know that I am God. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise, Praise the Lord. Lord.